Whew. What a day. We got the staircase, walls, upstairs the entire hallway, the second staircase, all the little spots upstairs that were left, the parlor ceiling and parlor wall. All of that plaster is now on the ground. Caleb and I can really get cracking on moving all that stuff to the dump on Saturday. But yeah, that was a tiring couple of days, but to be honest, really relaxing from normal work. Just not having to sit in the office and really doing something physically, even though I'm tired, it was really good um, as a, some relaxation therapy in between. Got the entire wall from one from the front to the back, plaster removed. In addition to that, the staircase in the back, everything is removed too. So it's really a great accomplishment for this for these couple of days.
the back staircase from all the way first floor till up to the third floor I got all the plaster and drywall removed from the walls from the ceilings around it um, the lath is still up but I will do that when the plaster is removed so I don't fall from the stairs You can see we made quite we made quite a progress here in the staircase too. Got everything removed besides that section up there. What I really need to do is when I get the ladder out to the ceiling, I will just have to do those sections that I just can't reach right now. I'll have to do those later when I don't have plaster all over the stairs. Beautiful Wednesday today. Made great progress yesterday, removing the entire hallway and finished off uh, a little bit more space upstairs. So today, goal for today is this ceiling.
here in the parlor, we also got everything removed, especially the ceiling, and then also this wall over here. We got removed so that we can most likely we'll have some duct work that probably has to go up into this wall. So that's why I figured I might as well get this wall done too instead of having to do it later. <clears throat> These last two days here were probably the dirtiest days that we had so far, especially with getting so much plaster removed at once. Um, I have a mess everywhere now. There's really no, no place is, that is clean right now. But even though that's a step backwards, even though we are cleaned up already a little bit, it really is a gigantic leap forward with really being almost done. We all, I can see the finish line already of the plaster removal. So I am exhausted. Gotta go home now. It is 4.30. Had a couple of um, at least eight hour days here at the house. So I'm going home now.
somebody wondered what those pipes are then in the middle of the, of the rooms always hang down well or that at least hung, hung down in this room i found it in some other rooms too they were just connected actually still to the ceiling so therefore they didn't just fall, fall down as soon as it took the ceiling off but basically what these pipes are or at least what i assume those pipes are this house is old enough that electricity was very rare in those houses at the beginning there and so before they had electricity they obviously wanted still lighting so they had um, tubing like that in the entire house to do gas lights so my assumption is that this house initially when it was built had gas lighting and that could also be the reason why we had some of the char uh, charring issues in some of the rooms it's Sunday here at the house and kind of tired been a long week so far uh, with being here on Tuesday and Wednesday and then additionally yesterday it took us an extra two hours just because of the detour and we had to drive quite a ways um, to meet our friend who let us use his address um, in a different county so we could go to the Danfield there since uh, the place that we normally go to kind of were low staffed and already didn't want to take our first load so instead of having to fight with them uh, just go to a different place but all that said we made really good progress this week on Tuesday and Wednesday I got here in the parlor the ceiling removed and also a portion of the wall here and then upstairs really all the last plaster that we had upstairs there's maybe little sections here or there where when I took the plaster down from the wall or from the ceiling maybe there was a half a foot of section that I just couldn't reach uh, with all the all, uh, existing plaster already on the floor so I have to do all of that final cleanup and then the only thing that I didn't get done here this week was the entry area I would assume here in the next couple weeks we will probably get the rest of the plaster removed so that we don't have to deal with that at, at all in the future so that would be really the goal I know kind of makes boring videos having every every week the same um, just filling up the truck again removing more plaster and then bringing it to the landfill and I know I'm tired of it too so looking forward to probably here in the next couple weeks get that done and then really get started on the rest of it obviously there will be a whole, probably an entire week video where I'm just gonna vacuum the whole place so get rid of the dust and also any of the insulation that is still in the walls that stayed up we will probably get uh, removed we'll, we'll probably remove all of that stuff too um, here with the, with the vacuum at one point so I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you next week and don't forget to subscribe like the video comment on the video um, it helps tremendously. Appreciate it. Thanks.